You might have noticed that for the graphs we have been looking at to date, we have plotted HETP value versus mobile phase velocity, and have talked about this rather than flow. There is a reason for this, and while it is true that as the flow increases, the mobile phase velocity also increases, it gets a little bit more complicated when we start changing the column inner diameter. As the diameter of the column is halved, the volume is reduced to a quarter of its former value. For example, the volume of a cylinder 10 centimeters long with an internal diameter of 4 millimeters is about 1.25 mils. The same length cylinder, but with a diameter now of 2 millimeters, has a volume of about 0.3 mils. For this reason, as the column diameter halves, we have to reduce the flow rate to a quarter of its former value to maintain the same velocity and therefore to maintain the same plate count.